What is up everybody? Jayco here today making another video about dating sites. Now, I guys, I talked to you guys about Bumble. I spoke to you guys about Tinder. Now let me get into another one. And I'm telling you guys about this because I've had the experience and I want you guys to know what it's like before making one of these accounts and taking time out of your dedicated life to make a social media or dating site or whatever you want to call it. So I'm gonna go with Plenty of Fish here. Now, Plenty of Fish is POF.com. Now, I used this site when I was younger and it was better, but as social media comes up with filters and stuff like that and other things, it has gotten a lot worse. Now, I'm gonna say that almost 25% of the users are botted accounts where they try and get you to view cams or try and get you to buy some type of subscription. And it's crazy because they actually message you. It's not just like you message them, they respond with an automated message. They actually message you. And I get about 75% of my messages coming in are, are fake. And when you look at the list of the girls that I look through, about one out of 50 girls are actually at my standards in looks, and looks aren't everything, but I'm gonna get into this. And that one out of 50 girl is a fake account. And you're like, well, how do you know? First of all, they don't even fill out their bio. Their pictures look like they were taken from Google. Um, and their username is the same fake username that everybody else uses, just slightly different. So it, it's kind of frustrating to see this. Most, and also most of these women on here, and there's nothing wrong with women with children, but a lot, like a high percentage of these women are with young kids where their fathers left them and now they're just looking for a guy. Uh, a lot of these uglier women, I don't want to say ugly, uh, less attractive women are just looking for sex. Okay? So the amount that actually interests me on there, not, not let me add the last category. A lot of these women have zero ambition and either work, you know, doing something that you make minimum wage. There's nothing wrong with the minimum wage job. It's just I'm looking for something a little bit higher up. Not that I'm proud of what I do, but I am... A web developer and a master personal trainer I do have a steady income so I, I guess I'm looking in the wrong direction hope you guys like my shirt by the way so if you're have if you have high standards you're looking for ambitious real women POF is not the place for you so I hope this video was informative to you guys I'm just waiting on this guy to help me build something um, then waiting on my ottoman that's supposed to be delivered and then I'm gonna go hit the gym my chest and shoulders are so sore from yesterday, but it feels oh so good. Take care, guys. Have a great day.